Excel documents are a common vector for malware, thanks to the ability to call Win32 APIs from within Excel spreadsheet formulas. In this video I'm going to show you how to analyze a malicious Excel document by using the newly introduced Silicon Excel emulator. The document is encrypted. This is not a problem, since Cerbero Suite decrypts it for us and we can access the decrypted document as a child object of the original file. Not everybody is aware of it, but Excel stores whenever possible the result of computed formulas, so just by looking at the records of the document we can often find the URL of the malicious payload. At this point our analysis could already be over, but we want to make sure that this is indeed a malicious payload. We go to the spreadsheet preview, from there we can start to follow the entry point called Auto Open. However, this can take a while if the malware contains flow obfuscation. An easier approach is to look for the function's call or register, one of the two is used to call Win32 APIs. We found the actual code of the malware. Now we can try to emulate the code by pressing Ctrl E or by using the context menu. Anytime the emulator encounters an unknown function it brings out the name and the arguments. We can see that the malware calls URL download to file with the URL we saw before and saves the data to a certain location on disk. It looks like the emulator entered an execution loop. This is due to some trick used by the malware. It's not a big issue, as we're missing only the final P letter from the URL. We could easily fix this glitch from Python, but there's no need as at every step of the way we can verify the correctness of the end result against the pre-computed values stored by Excel, which are shown in the cell above the formula. The second call function simply calls shell execute to run the malicious payload from the location on disk and that's it. While the sample contains some anti-emulation tricks, we could easily overcome them by performing an interactive analysis.